Hello everyone, Mike Grempel from Another Set of Eyes with today's Excel Bytes blog post. Today we're going to take a look at um, conditionally formatting the rows in a data range based on the values or data in one of the columns of that range. So here we have a table or a, a data range and you can see we have uh, 214 rows, 213 items there, and it has country, salesperson, etc. And what I want to do is highlight the rows um, that are in the country USA. So um, first what we'll do is I'm going to hold down my shift control and hit my right arrow key and then my down arrow key to highlight the area. And I'm going to click on conditional formatting from the home tab and I'm going to select new rule. And the rule is going to be using a formula to determine which cells to format. So I'm going to click on that. And what my formula is going to be is equals A2, A2 being the upper leftmost cell in the range that I highlighted that I want to format. And I also want to keep it in column A, but I want it to go down the different rows. So I'm going to... Uh, hit my F4 key once, twice, three times to lock the A, but keep the uh, 2, which is the row number uh, relative. And then I'm going to say equals, and then in quotes, USA, oops, USA, end quotes, and then let me choose my formatting. And I'm going to just format it in that color, say OK, say OK. And there you go. Any row that has USA as a country has now highlighted the entire row, not just the USA that's in column A. If this happened to change to, say, UK, that whole row would uh, not be highlighted. I change it back. Or if I change another one to USA, it then will highlight and format that entire row. Uh, for that uh, because based on the USA in column A. And there you have it. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you liked it. If you'd like to see more, please go to my blog, excel-bytes.com, and feel free to subscribe. Happy excelling.